Hello, and I hope everybody's doing well. I'm officially back on YouTube with my first vlog since about, I think it was May. Um, I tend to take the summer off of landscape photography just because it's really early morning, it's really late nights, and the light I find really quite harsh throughout the time as well. Uh, however, we are back, and as it's getting darker at night, I am now up in the Kelpies, just up at Falkirk. Um, so we're going to do some night photography here and it's really quite busy at the moment which i was quite surprised at so we've got a couple of hours before the car park closes so i'm going to wander around here and see if we can get some shots of these lit up mystical horses So as you can see, I've got the Kelpies just behind me and what I'm going to be doing over the next half hour or so is just kind of walking around, um, just trying them from different angles. Um, my first shot I think I'm going to go for this guy here. I'm going to cut out the other horse and keep this guy and I'm going to go square on, try and fill the frame with his big face and there's some, I don't, hard to see it on the camera, there's some really nice kind of blue hour with some um, blue sky in between and that actually looks really really good on the photo. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stand here, they change colour every now and again, so I'm just going to take a few shots of each colour and then decide which one I like best in post. So I'll get this one taken and then I will head on and see what other angles we've got. to a kind of small water feature just in front of the kelpies and there was loads of reflections a minute ago which I've managed to miss and uh, my dad's managed to get a decent shot of them so I'm going to stand here for another couple of minutes uh, just to see if the wind dies down a wee bit the reflections come back and maybe get a decent shot if they happen to get something they'll put it up if not then you can take it or get nothing so stand about for another couple of minutes and see what we get Right, so I've managed to find a wee bit of light, as you can see. Um, so just making our way around, um, just taking different shots from different angles and just taking a few each time as the colours are changing. Uh, this time I am shooting with a wide angle lens and I'm shooting basically vertically upwards. Um, I've got one of the horses kind of right in the foreground and the other one slightly in the background. Uh, vertical composition and I need to try and sort it out in post because it's going to be a bit warped just because of how wide the, uh, the angle of the lens is. Um, so I'm going to get this taken. Most of the shots have been taken on F8, run about kind of 8 to 10 seconds. Um, so I'm going to get this one done and then move around for the last 20 minutes or so and just see if we can get another couple of shots before we go. Uh, but so far it's been pretty worthwhile.
this time I've just made my way around the back of the Kelpies and as you've probably seen in the bit of footage before um, there's some really nice twisted patterns uh, within the Kelpies so what I'm going to do is again use the vertical uh, the wide angle lens and shoot vertically up at it uh, just to let those kind of twisted shapes all kind of merge in and go through the image so it's been really really good so far um, if you've never been it's definitely worth coming up here I think if you're going to do it, do it at night, it's much more impressive than it is during the day and the shots you can get at night are absolutely brilliant as well, so really enjoyed it. So I'm going to get a couple more taken and then I think it might be time to hit the road, but really successful so far I think. So better get this one taken. Right, so we've just finished up at the Kelpies, um, so we've decided just to take the couple of mile drive over to the Falkirk Wheel. Um, I've actually never been at the Falkirk Wheel, um, I think the last time, well, I probably have, I think the last time I was here I was really, really young. Um, so I'm going to take a walk up there, uh, there is a couple of shots to be had up there, so I'm going to take a wander up and just see if there's anything there that we can shoot. And we'll get headed back down the road, I think, yeah. So we've taken a pop over to the Falkirk Wheel and the first shot that we, we spotted was as soon as we got out of the car park. Um, it's just the top car park right as the path starts and as you can see you've got a lovely view of the whole sort of canal all the way along at the end. So I'm just going to stand here, take a long kind of wide angle shot of it and then crop it maybe in a 16 by 9 um, ISO 500 now and F6.3. Reason being is because there's a couple of dodgy lights uh, just down at the bottom there and they're really causing a bit of hassle so just trying to keep the shutter speed as short as possible. Um, shutter speed's around about 8 seconds which isn't too bad. So I'm going to get this taken and then take a wander up the top there and see if we can get a shot looking right down the canal. So here's the shot. So made it up to the top of the Falkirk wheel um, and the colours are really nice as you can see there's a few bright neon lights around that I'm getting blinded by um, We're currently standing on the edge of a, of a sticky out towpath such looking down the canal and the object is to try and get the rings behind us reflecting in the water It's a bit of a pain because you're not looking directly down the middle you are slightly off to the side um, so it's really just about getting the focal length right and trying to make it look as straight as possible um, So I'm going to take a few shots as the colours start to change and then we're going to call it quits for tonight because it's getting quite late and I can't stand any more of these colours to be honest. So I'll get these taken and then get head back. So that's us just finished at the Falkirk Wheel, and um, that was the last shot of the night. It's been pretty good, um, the colours and the lights and stuff like that on the Kelpies and both the Falkirk Wheel have been really really nice. Um, there's just a little bit of wind um, that's causing a bit of a nuisance with the reflections, so it's definitely another one to come back for. Um, but that is us for tonight, we're going to get headed back down the road. Uh, if you enjoyed the video then please give it a like, and if you really enjoyed it and want to see some more videos then give us a subscribe as well. So thanks very much and we'll see you all later.